Connectors in PowerPoint are a very versatile and useful tool. They allow us to connect multiple shapes together in a way that we can define dynamic. Let me show you how that works. I can connect two shapes from one anchor point to the other anchor point. The moment I create a line and I anchor it to the anchor point, just dragging and releasing over the specific anchor point, I can then move the shape around and the connector will automatically follow. Connectors can be straight or they can have elbows. Why do we need elbows? For example, we need elbows to create custom diagrams. Imagine organigram charts. In this case, having elbows is fundamental to create hierarchies. Elbows can be adjusted by pulling this yellow dot. But let's suppose I am in a situation like this, in which this yellow dot is higher than this yellow dot, and I want them to be aligned. One thing I can do is select the first one, select the second one, the first one will be in my reference, and then I will use a new function from MLC PowerPoint Adim called align horizontal, dedicated to the yellow elbows dots. The moment I click it, the two yellow dots will be aligned together. Last but not least, a very cool option is that you can even create anchor points that are completely custom. For example, if I wanted to connect this rectangle to this square, I would have to use one of the four anchor points existing by default. But if I wanted to add one anchor point, I could easily do that. I right click it, edit points, click here, right click, add point. The moment in which I add a point, I have it here as a new anchor point. And I can use it to connect my shapes. PowerPoint connectors are a very versatile yet powerful tool that enable us to connect multiple shapes together in a way that they readjust depending on the position. I believe they are very useful and I think that you can make great use of that, especially in organigram charts, flow charts, and any kind of chart that is represented by the connection of multiple shapes. I wish you to make the best use of them and I'm looking forward to your comments. I wish you great presentations.